This one's called The Worst Sound. What's the worst sound you've ever heard? Buy me a drink, I'll tell you about a death, a sound, and the end of a dream. It was ten years ago. I was a young Church of Scotland minister. Yeah, I know, I don't look, don't look like a man in the cloth, but hear me out. Matt Duncan was dying when I got to him. Thin bubbles of blood were coming at his mouth and his nose. His wife had called me, pleading to come, looking for help in his last hours. I was young. I was sure of my faith. But the sight of those eyes and the thin rasping sound in his chest made my heart lurch with pity for him. He was trying to speak and I had to lean close to hear him. Bless me, Father, for I have sinned, he said. I tried to tell him I wasn't Catholic, but he merely grabbed my hand hard and began to speak. I won't bother you with the details. His life, as he told it, was full of theft and mayhem, sexual depravity, murder, even. I felt bile rise up in my throat as he told me one particular story about a 12-year-old girl that he'd hurt. But my God's a merciful God. I prayed with him. I told him that God would care for him. And I'd just reached the end of the prayer when I heard the death rattle in his throat. I put his hand in his chest and bent my head to pray. And that was when I heard it. The room hummed. It was a far-off sound, heavy machinery. And then a bell rang, hard and tinny. It echoed around the small room. There was a sliding, metallic noise like a door opening and a deep voice intoned the words. The words I've heard every night ever since. Going down. <laughs>